Detroit Lions fans, how we doing? Um, this video is not going to be for the algorithm. It's going to be for me and for you. I got videos planned out. I'm, I'm tagging them and having the thumbnails, doing the thumbnails. They're going to come out pretty quickly, probably 7, 8, 9, 8, 9, 10, somewhere around there. But I wanted to take a moment. It's about for the algorithm, but I don't care. Um, I, I just wanted to say that I am truly thankful for this community. Not only have I received super thanks and donations um, to keep this journey going forward, but I learned a long time ago that it is good to be good, meaning it's always better to be always be yourself. Never become anybody else for anyone else. And if you go through something from whatever it is, don't change who you are as a person, because if you do that, you're not going to be happy. I became an individual through all the stuff that I had been on on this platform. Some of you, you've seen it. Some of you uh, have not, but I've been through quite a bit. Um, and going through that, I changed who I was as a person. I told myself that I would never collaborate. I would never do anything with anyone. I would never help anybody on YouTube. I would never, I would just stand this little box and bubble, make my content and become who I am. That would be the new me, not the real me, the new me, the hardened, battle tested, the guy that's saying, you know what? I'm not going to let anything bad happen to me again when it comes to the internet. Because we, the internet is a painful place. It can be a, a real painful place. For example, the lady that at, talked to T Todd Bowles, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers coach, about the Dome, she was from a very small news team that they had. They didn't have any sports people. So they sent this, this woman out, and now she's the brunt of everyone jokes on the internet. And it's unfortunate because she didn't know I mean, that's like asking my wife. She knows we we play in Ford Field because she works downtown. Outside of that, she probably wouldn't know. She doesn't care anything about – well, she didn't. You know, she cares now, but she did, she's not – if you're not into sports and you're down there, I mean, you know, it was sad. But I like to help people. I've always been like that. And I'm not just talking about here on YouTube. I'm talking about period. And um, what I've always had is a truly – great community. And I keep saying that I have the best community on YouTube. There's a person who I'm not going to say who they are just yet. And if they, I don't know if they even want me to, but they talked to me about potentially a, the NFC title game, but this video here, and, and I hear you and I see you and we definitely going to chop it up. But this video here is, I want to show you just what being continue to being nice. Continue to be yourself. And it truly is better to give than receive, right? This right here is, you guys know I'm going to the game. And this right here is my ticket. I got it. It's in my wallet right now. And you can see the front, the, the tag says, remember to be good people with the teary emoji. Because I was going to be I, had, I was going to get there. The ticket prices are ridiculous. They're ridiculous. And I wouldn't have been able to afford to be there. I was going, I had my ticket, but I had my ticket because of me basically being connected to a season ticket holder because they get very, you know, they get first dibs and things are a lot better for them. So, I was going to be in there. I know I couldn't afford to go otherwise. I know. And, and I'm going to tell you what, watching it at home is one thing, but watching these games live, being able to be part of history is insane. I don't know why the Detroit Lions have the highest price tickets in the entire NFL for this run. I don't, I don't know why. I know it's great for the economy, but you know, that's still, that's still kind of bold to outprice people to get in the door for this game is insane. And I know that it's going to, when they win, it's going to be like any other thing. We're, we're talking about history right now. We're, we're witnessing history. We literally are. So I was going to be there, but I wasn't going to be where I'm at now. I will be sitting in section 105. That's where I'm going to be sitting. Now, this is no knock on anyone else. JBL gave me a ticket for free. I asked him, did he want anything? He said no which I appreciate. And seats were ridiculous. They were amazing. Had a great time. Went the other day. I've had people reach out 
to me in my DMs and they're telling me, hey, you know, what can I do to help you get there? This is why it's important to stay who you are, stay true to yourself. Don't let what you've gone through dictate who you become because you will be appreciated. And sometimes, and, and, and I'm going to tell you what, I'd rather be appreciated. I'd rather be respected and appreciated by you, the fan, than the Detroit Lions or anybody else. No big media. No, the, the goal of this channel was never to rise through the ranks of, you know, get noticed by the Lions. Maybe start working for the Lions. I don't want I don't want that. I mean, being noticed would be great because I could bring more content to you guys. But it's not like so I can be like, oh, you know, we're brothers just bumping shoulders with, you know, whoever. And I'm not if you do that, that's fine. That's not what I'm, I'm trying. I'm not trying to take a shot at anybody. I'm just saying that was never my goal. My goal, because I don't want to be where I'm scared to say something about a player because I don't like the way they play. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to have those restrictions. And one thing about YouTube is you don't have those restrictions. Nobody, there are no strings on me. There are the, the only strings on me is what you can and cannot say on YouTube as far as their uh, monetization policy, which is very, 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 it doesn't even go in line with what I talk about anyway. So I just want to say thank you. Thank you to everyone who supported this channel. Thank you for to everyone. We are the we're approaching the second best channel in Lions content and strictly Lions content. We are we are approaching. We are very close to being the second best channel. When I say best channel, the second most subscribed channel outside of the Detroit Lions. And if you want to take. If you want an independent channel, if you want to have an independent channel, I this channel here because of you guys is is approaching the first the highest subscribed independent channel when i say independent i mean not connected to the detroit lions or any bigger media group on the internet this will be very soon by the end of this lions run we will be the, the number one channel that is strictly detroit lions outside of channels that have partnered with bigger media we don't clickbait we don't do none of that stuff. And I know it's a longer video, but, and, and I shouldn't even put it out. It, it Sometimes you got to just say, you know, what bump the algorithm. I want to talk to my people. So thank you. Thank you to everyone who has DM me, who has super thanks, who has super chatted, who has watched an ad, who has supported me on this journey because it's not me, it's us. And that's what I had to realize. Derek is not about you. Of course. Yeah. I'm going to be like, you know, blah, blah, blah in the comment section and blah, blah. You know, I'm, I'm going to give you some pushback, but without you supporting me by watching my videos and, you know, subscribing, all that stuff. I'm, I, tr I truly believe that the bigger I get, the more other people will notice. And then that'll allow me to bring you more content, more content from maybe from the inside. Again, I don't want to work for the Lions. That's not what I want to do. I want to be inside of Ford Field if I can as a fan. I don't want to work for the Detroit Lions. If I could bring you training camp stuff as a, you know, with more access, I would love that. But that's not what I, you know, I'm not striving to get there and all that stuff. I'm not going to be begging people and all that. They'll notice me. One thing that I know about the internet is that with great influence comes great access. Influence will grant access. It just is because you, the more influence you have, the more notice that you can bring to the Detroit Lions or any other, whatever you're representing or talking about. So because of the whole point of this video is for me to say thank you and for me to really show my, gener my, my appreciation for your generosity, the person that helped me get this ticket, <laughs> the people who watch the videos, the people who DM me, the relationships that I have are off the internet that are from the internet. It's, it's insane. It, I mean, it's insane. It's unreal. I was trying to mix two words together. So thank you. This is the content out of the norm. I appreciate no matter what I see in the comment section. I appreciate appreciate every one of you. And you know what really gets me? What really gets me is the people that cannot be here. The people that can't watch the game. You can't get to the game. You can't afford to, to get to the game. You sitting at home with oxygen or whatever. And you are living through my experience. 
and it, it's it's quite the responsibility to have, but I uh, accept that responsibility, and I just want to say thank you. Thank you. There was a time that I almost quit YouTube. I almost quit it. But I didn't. And uh, I'm because of that, I'm here and able to, to try to give you the best content possible. Sometimes we can make it about ourselves. And, you know, I, I have to have that kind of moxie because otherwise you just get run over. If you don't have the moxie that you're the best and you want to be the best internally, you will get run over. It's a new creator born every day. You cannot take your foot off the gas. So that's what you see from me. But on the inside, I am. I mean, that's who I am. Like, I'm, I'm determined and I'm not going to let anything stop me. But I almost did. I almost did. I almost let something stop me. And uh, I wouldn't have been here to make this content. As far as I would have just stopped, I would have gave up and wouldn't have kept going. So this video is long, emotional, but and shouldn't even be made because the algorithm is not going to appreciate it but i i do and i want to say thank you so let's go get this w you guys are awesome take care of yourself i appreciate every last one of you take care of yourself and each other and as always go lions and i want to say thank you to each and every one of you for your support